how about we completely skip the fact that I look rough and we just don't mention that at all. So ever since I was really young, I've always liked journaling or like writing in my little diary or whatever. Ever since I was like really, really young, I would say like third or fourth grade, that's when I really started, not gonna lie. I have two diaries here with me and this is what they look like. I'm not really sure which one I started writing in first. I haven't read these in years i haven't written them ever since i believe i was like i want to say 15 or 16 but i definitely took a lot of breaks in between i didn't write for like from third grade to like i was 15 but i think i am first going to start off with this one since i'm pretty sure i did start with this one how they how i said and then moved on to this one i'm pretty much just going to be exposing myself as i said my handwriting was definitely interesting okay yeah so i started writing this when i was in third grade wow the quotes that i have on this side are <laughs> interesting wow guys my spelling if you guys saw this okay i'm definitely going to insert some pictures and if you personally know me you know i am a horrible speller and clearly i've always been a horrible speller <laughs> my favorite hobby was ball wall <laughs> i don't know if you guys remember playing that in elementary school but i definitely do my goal is be a doctor of babies because they are cute who's ready to go on to the first page okay this was back in january february march april may june july july 1st 2010 that was 11 years ago. I was eight. Here's what it says. Dear diary, I had a bad dream. It was about dot, 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 dot. Julio, which is my older brother, had a staple. He, he popped it where my mustache is. It was scary. Thank God he got it again. And I was wearing a hat. He popped one there and I lift my hat so that he won't cut my hair but he did and when i woke up i checked if i had them and i did not i woke up crying i hate those kind of dreams and sometimes dreams can come true they could be happy sad scary creepy and gross that is why i hate dreams but let's move on to the next page. Oh, this is right the next day. Okay. So this was July 2nd, 2010. And this is written in yellow. Uh-huh. I don't know how I'm going to read this. Okay. I'm going to read what I can. I have not gone anywhere. I think that I am going to a trip. I am not sure where. Beautiful. Okay. Good to know. Next page. Doesn't even have a date beautiful dear diary the thing that i am not going to like is that i can't invite my friends over okay i don't know what i was talking about um fast forward october 11th 2010 dear diary i had the best trip ever i went to mexico all my cuz are really big i have not gone for three years oh this is a whole nother year later i actually i think i know what this is about this is september 5th 2011 dear diary i got my first bra but it's a kid's bra i got two packs of two for 2.99 yellow and white and blue and white oh my god i am no happy it doesn't have a sponge it fits me good. When I got them, I was like, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, I got my first bra. I was so happy I got it today at factory to you oh my god okay then oh this is the same day again beautiful we didn't go the both fountain garden because kenny didn't go i got so sad but my dad said we were going to sula's park and then i said if we could go to discount mall so we did we went to sula's park but we but we didn't know there was going to i don't know what that says but i was really wet and full of sand so i i don't know what that says to borrow some jeans okay i knew it gets juicy at some point so by the sticker as we can see secret crush this was december 27th 2010 oh so i went back a year i don't know i have a crush on juan fun fact this is my current boyfriend he goes to my class he is nine years old just like me but he wins me by one month he is september i am october i think he is cute not hot 
I just have a crush on him. He does not know. Okay, fun fact. Yes, I have liked my boyfriend since third grade. I literally have proof. Um, I've been dating him for over four years now, almost five years. Wild, I know. I always thought that it was super inappropriate to call guys hot. Like, I thought that was super like, oh my god, like, like you just don't do that. So, long story short, I thought it was very, very, very inappropriate to call a guy hot. So, that is why I said he is not hot. He's cute. Oh, this is another one from the same day. Okay. Dear Diary, I think Taylor Lautner is hot. <laughs> beautiful i just contradicted myself completely okay he has a six pack oh my god julio thinks he has those ah uh, anyways oh here's another page of the same day also i've always been a huge fan of chris brown i literally have a page about him this is a cutout that my cousin gave to me i honestly don't even know what this says i've never read it in my whole entire life to be completely honest he's literally a cutie what else can i say this is january 24th okay so it says dear diary i can't believe that i passed the test of the primera comunión which is first communion so that means that god is going to be in my heart and that was my dream. It's going to be at a park. So I'm guessing my party was going to be at a park. Or at my house. Okay, this is May 21st, 2011. It says, Dear Diary, I did my Primera Comunión, which once again is the first communion. It was the best day and time of my life. My dad cooked pasta white and red with bread it was the best pasta ever i had a very tall trampoline it was kind of hard from the inside my padrinos were adrian and his mom i had chocolate cake i got 50 dollars i got 12 lip glosses a really pretty purse from justice my best present was three air apostle shirts and two air apostle shirts from my nina i didn't Oh, I'm not going to say that. That kind of just exposes my family a little bit, but I cannot say that. June 1st, 2011. Here, diary. I'm mad with Juan and with Salvador because they told on me. I'm not going to go into detail, but I actually do remember this day. I was calling them some names and they told on me. And the teacher sent me outside pretty much. And I just had a talk with him and I was in a rebel, I swear, like I was actually a good kid. Okay, so the next entry is also from the same day. It says, Dear Diary, it was my first time to talk to the teacher. It felt very weird. It because Wendy was saying, I don't know what that says, and then it says dream. Okay, fun fact, Wendy's my best friend. Um, I don't really know what that was about, but okay. Oh, this is another entry from the same day. Perfect. I am in love with JB, Justin Bieber. I heart you, JB. I am a big fan. I just saw the movie Never Say Never on may 31st 2011 yesterday that was the best movie ever he is so hot i love all his songs he is super duper hot and cute i'm going to see him very soon fun fact i've never seen him till this day so i was lying october 13th 2011 dear diary since oscar likes me he asked me out today and i said no he told me hey i need to tell you something may i and i said okay and he said Okay, this is my sister's opinion. She told me to ask you out, so yes or no? I said no. Then he said, so no, right? And I said, no. And then I left. Really, Oscar? I literally put, really, Oscar. I do remember who he is, though. Um, I forgot about this, but I, like, kind of remember it. Not really. Okay, so this goes back to January, March, April, May, June? June 4th. So we throw it back now. Dear diary, school is going to be out. I might go to fourth grade. Might. Beautiful. Okay. I think I passed third grade. For summer, my dad said we might go to Six Flags again, but we have... I'm not going to say that either because it exposes my family. <laughs> oh, what? Okay, sorry. I can't say that. October 13th, 2011. Dear diary, I am so nervous and happy. Because tomorrow I'm going to go on the O'Neill boat. I think I'm going to get seasick. I'm so nervous. Fun fact, I did get very seasick. I remember that day. It was the next day, October 14th, 2011. Dear diary, I went on the boat. I did get seasick. Good thing I didn't get 
be sick. What? <laughs> okay, me and Alyssa were really nervous when we were about to get on it. There is a net on the floor and me and Alyssa thought we were gonna fall off and we tried seaweed. It's very salty. We got at school like at 4 45 oh my god i got on a big boat yeah i i anyways next ah i'm really exposing myself here okay so this entry is about juan and another guy let's call him daniel that's not his real name i don't think he watched in the videos i hope he doesn't anyways dear diary since the first day of school, which was August 29th, 2011, I've had a crush on Daniel. But I don't know who to choose because I still have a crush on Juan. Wow, beautiful. But somehow, Daniel talks all weird. I don't know why. But I don't know who to choose, Daniel or Juan, because I have a crush on them both. And they are cute and they are adorable. Wow, beautiful. Okay, first of all, I'm literally acting like as if I'm getting married here. Second of all, who did I think I was? Like, what? <laughs> Anyways, fast forward, I, I ended up, I had a thing with Daniel in eighth grade right before I um started dating Juan. So, it's, that was a quick little update on that. Dear diary. Today, I finally shaved my armpits. It didn't feel as bad as I thought it would. I kind of laughed. But just a little bit but it smells so good didn't hurt at all but oh my god it smells so good and wherever you shave it leaves it so soft and smooth ah, ha, 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 ha. do you guys want to see my drawing she's a cutie and i still have a lot more pages to go like so many more pages to go i haven't even like when i say i have a lot to go i have a lot to go i think this is simply going to be just a part one i will end this right here if you guys want to see a part two let me know and when i tell you it gets juicy it gets juicy like i write pages and pages like you guys can see pages and pages and this is already me into high school well, not high school middle school so stuff stuff starts happening in my life um but yeah let me know if you guys want a part two um thank you so much for watching as i said if you guys want a part two definitely let me know i am excited for a part i'm excited for part two if you're excited for a, for a part two just give it a thumbs up subscribe if you haven't already join my little family that we have going on right here and yeah thank you so much for watching i will see you guys in my next video bye guys